morning. Uh, can you close on tour? We have arrived in Jordan, so we're going to spend next week here. Uh, so you see a lot of <coughs> videos. But uh, today we're actually not in Jordan. Well, we are in Jordan. Right now we're just on our way down. We're at sea level right now. And uh, later on we're going to spend the day in Israel, going to Jerusalem, Bethlehem and see these areas. So it's going to be a great video that's going to be shot today. All right, we have now uh, just uh, left the Jordan border. We're in a shuttle bus that's going to take us across no man's land. And then we're coming into Israel. So it's super exciting. All right, we made it into Jerusalem and uh, we're just in Mount Olive right now. Um, this is actually the rock that Jesus stood on before he descended to heaven on resurrection. We were actually quite lucky because we just managed to come here when a German church group was here singing. Absolutely fantastic. So that's where the whole thing ended. <laughs> So we are now in the Church of Elena, where uh, Jesus actually taught the Apostles how to uh, pray. And it's actually written in 140 different languages, all the prayers here. And I'm so lucky, just found the Danish ones, which I did actually remember parts of. So let's see what we get more. All right, still in Mount uh, Olive. Uh, just have a beautiful view over Jerusalem here. Uh, we see the, the Muslim shrine over there. And we see all of it and the wall around the old city. We're going to go down there in a second. Uh, Paul is getting a huge uh, religious uh, thing going on here. So, uh, no, it's really cool. It's hot though. You know, fear, shape, fear drop share, shape. You know, when somebody. Still got Jerusalem background. Right now we're walking down here. And this is actually a very famous path because this is where the people played the palm leaves for Jesus. So this is where we celebrate Palm Sunday. How cool is that? All right, we're now in another church, which is Church of Germany, I think it's called. And this church is built uh, because this is here with Judas, he actually betrayed Jesus. This is the last place Jesus was a free man. Uh, he was taken off to prison and beaten, and we know what happens after that here. Uh, it's a fairly new church, but it has that feeling, even for a non-Christian like me. We just entered the tomb of Mary, uh, Jesus' mom. Uh, quite a special place, I must say that. It's like a half a cave, half a church. And here we have uh, the place. Sorry, I have to whisper, we have to be quiet. I'm actually inside the tomb of Mary. Wow. I'm not sure we're allowed to film it, but we do it anyway. So this is where Mary is. Mary. Cool. So, now finally we're getting to the city walls of uh, Jerusalem. One of the gates in, so let's see what's in on the other side. All right, we're now walking through uh, old Jerusalem. We're actually following the path where Jesus uh, was carried on his cross before he got crucified. Uh, really, really amazing here. Um, let's look. Pretty cool. Here is number. Still on the way in, okay, we're still following. That's number five, stop. The five stop here, we're still following Jesus' trail to the small street. And um, funny enough, right up there, that's where he took his first rest with the cross. We're gonna take a rest now. All right, so um, made it uh, in Jerusalem. We uh, jumped a little bit off uh, Jesus' Spanish road, and we're now at the Wheeling Wall. Uh, Paul just went in and um, put a little message for mommy there, so that's pretty cool. Uh, for a non-religious person like me, 
it still has something. I must admit, it's it's quite amazing to stand here. Uh, you see all these people coming here. Let me go a little bit closer and film so you also can see uh, how it sits behind me. But uh, amazing place, Jerusalem, place to be. What do you think, Paul? Cool. cool. We have to wear these funny hats, kept flying off. And okay, let's do this, Paul. Okay, try and get this thing to fit on that here. Not easy. Anyway, we did it our respect, so we did it. Look, there's some more. Alright, so we actually got to the Basilica right now. Uh, where the last stations, we walked the whole way where Jesus walked with the cross. I'm sympathizing with him. Um, we're going to go inside and uh, see where he got crucified and where the latent rest in the cave. Wow! Huh? Okay, we got Paul here. So we're becoming all religious in this place there. Pretty cool. All right. We are on the last bit of the walk into the church. See the last five stations. Quite a lot of tourists here. But I'm sure this is going to be extremely cool. So behind me here is where actually Jesus was crucifixed. This is the rock that cracked after when the earthquake happens after the crucifixion. Um, so this is actually one of the holiest, holiest places. Um, I shot a little video so you can see it also. Ah, cool. We are in the church right now and we just went in to see us. You can see I filmed a little bit, they are allowed actually in uh, the great chapel of Jesus. But, hey, did anybody think I was John Lennon there? No, but wow. So our next stop is going to be yeah, some more religious places. We'll see where we go. Really fantastic. Worth to go to Israel if you have the possibility. So we arrived in Bethlehem. There's a church, which used to be a barn. So this is where Jesus is born. Uh, apparently it's going to be a bit of a tough one to get down to the crib where he was born, but we tricked our way in with Paul's hair last place. So let's see if that doesn't work. But um, we crossed over to the Bethlehem side. Uh, really amazing also. Let's see right behind me here. So let's see what we get inside. It's actually the crib that Jesus was uh, laid in after he was born. So, pretty holy place. And right over here, Paul just touched, and that's where Jesus was born. Wow. Better get out. There's a lot of people who want to do this also. Well, thank you very much for following today. Uh, we're back in Amman. We're back in Jordan. Uh, what a day. Totally amazing. And we're back at the hotel and to see how Mr. Paul, he did. It's not that late, but it was a long day, but really cool. Tomorrow, we're gonna go to the desert, so I hope you wanna follow us again on the next video. Thanks for seeing it today.